Hey there, YouTube. So, um, this might go up on Friday as a second video rather than Thursday. My internet's down. It's like a regional thing. Um, but I promised that we'd go through my binders real quick. I only have two, and they're not full, so this won't be super long. But um, I like to see um, people's binders like I like to see uh, Real Breaking Nate's the stuff that he does. Uh, I don't know if Lee and Hart's done anything, but I like to watch stuff like that. So, um, so I thought we'd start by going through what I currently have of the Sword and Shield set. This binder is only Sword and Shield cards, and then just my other cards. Like this is my other binder um, with just I don't know various rares and ultra rares. Um, I don't have a whole lot because I, so I started collecting Pokemon cards pretty much when it came out um, in the 90s. Um, then I stopped. <laughs> my mom got rid of all my cards and then I'd start over. And I started over within the last year, so I don't have a whole lot yet. But let's start with Sword and Shield. So with this... Um, I have been organizing them in number order. Um, let's get this. Is, you can see my computer screen in there as well. There we go. So um, I only have... I've only opened probably... I can't see. Make sure we're getting everything in here. There's that uh, Torkoal V that I got a couple days ago. <clears throat> That's better. I should do this. Um, oh, I think my internet just went back up. Got this here. So um, I'm trying to get the reverse hollows and the normal cards. So right here you can see that with this Krabby, I got both. The regular and the... Oh, that's in the wrong spot. Hold on. Hold up. That's 43. That's 42. That's in the wrong spot. How did I do that? Oh, no. <laughs> Make sure I get them all right, I guess. Um, continuing here, got the Intellion holographic. So I know there's going to be a non hollow as well. So when I find that, that'll sit behind the hollow card. Uh, same with the bolt end. I have the hollow rare, but not quite. I don't have the uh, non holographic version yet. But when I get that, it'll sit behind there. Um, Poltegeist. That is the reverse hollow. Down here, Poltegeist. And then Hitmonlee, I have both. This one I know for sure is correct. I got the hollow, or the uh, reverse hollow and the regular. Uh, same with Baltoy, reverse hollow and regular. I got Claydol, reverse hollow here. I know it's kind of hard to see, but um, you should be able to zoom in, like pause and zoom in if you want, if you're on a phone. Um, we got, let's see, Thievel. I was kind of unimpressed with Thievel as a concept, if I'm completely honest. Um, but, you know, there you go. Got the two Wooloos. Yeah. I got the Wooloo promo in the back. You'll see that later from our opening the other day. Um, getting into, so here's a Cramorant V from our opening the other day. <clears throat> trainer cards. I don't, some people like the trainer cards. I'm more interested in seeing the actual Pokemon cards. Uh, this one right here. Professor's Research. Full art. It's uh, about, right now, last I checked, was about $19 and something cents. 80 something cents. I got the Secret Rare Air Balloon. Eventually I'll get good at this. <laughs> Positioning these for the camera. So the reverse or the, the Secret Rare Air Balloon, and then I got the three promos, the Glossifleur from the other day, the Wooloo from the other day, and then a more Peko promo from a three-pack blister that I got before I started this channel up. Um, so that's all I got for Sword and Shield. I mean, it's not a whole lot. It is a lot, but it's not like... I don't even think it's halfway done. Um, and I know it's kind of hard to see... Through this camera, this isn't the best camera. I'm going to try and get a better one in the future. Excuse me. Um, 
But this binder's got a lot... <sighs> there's, there's more to it. Like, this is my binder with all my, like I said, my ultra rares. Um, so you got a... This was the first ultra rare I got, this Full Art Turtonator GX. And I was also super excited to get this uh, Mega Charizard EX there. Um, and these are in here in order of which I got them, like, as I pulled them. Um, for the most part, I pulled these out of packs. There's some that I actually got from my brother-in-law, who gave me a bunch of his old cards recently. Um, more ultra rares there. And then these are all rare psychic types. I got a couple different Mews whoop, up here couple different views up here. Um, I could probably put the two clay dolls one right behind the other because they're the same Pokemon, but there you go. <clears throat> that right there, the Zapdos over here, uh, that is from, it's, so it's got the red HP. So that's from base set. I think that's from base set. 1990, 1999. So it's, it's from when Wizards was still printing the cards so it's old um so that's pretty cool uh and then another zapdos but this one's a lot newer uh secret rare surfing pikachu like that secret rare now that if if you get if you're someone with the hollow version of this that's worth about 25 bucks at the moment this one's worth like maybe four if that i don't even think it's worth quite that much <clears throat> okay more here so there's there's a couple cards in particular i am going to stop and like actually show you up at the camera because they're they're pretty cool um meltan down there metagross two different metagross artworks down here from uh different sets i believe yes from different sets um got dialga and Cobalion up here. Um, a is that a base set? No, it's absolutely not a base set. Oh, you know what? That's from Evolutions. These two are both from Evolutions. Um, these Chanseys. I thought they were from the base set, but they are not. Uh, that RCS X. That's pretty cool. Um, Rayquaza C level x and then rayquaza ex so those are some pretty interesting cards as well uh this is about ten dollars at the moment uh as of a couple days ago when i checked um i'm looking for my fire types here we go so super interesting we got a fire type arbok right here which I thought was weird, so I'm wondering if there was a set from betw between when I stopped collecting when I started collecting again. Um, so, yeah, I, I don't know. Th this isn't the only card that I came across with a different type than the actual Pokemon. And then this Charizard right here is... Uh, so it's a reverse foil Charizard. I'm not sure from what set, but right now that's at $25. Um, so that's pretty cool. And then I got this cool Arcanine down here. Two Reshirams, one Hollow, one Reverse Hollow. And then here's the old stuff. Here's uh, here's the old stuff. Got a Dark Champ down here, Japanese version. Two First Edition Machamps up here. Uh, let's see which which of these are First Edition. That's first edition, that's first edition, Dark Charizard Japanese, uh, first edition unknown. Sorry if you can hear that, it's Discord, and quite frankly annoying. Um, uh, yeah. Blaine's Arcanine. Uh, the Mew promos. Uh, again, when Wizards of the Coast was still printing these, you got the Articuno over here. This old, 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 um, like, I don't remember. I think this was from the, one of the movies. I don't remember where this was from. But it's got a cool back to it, too. 
so it's different. Um, and then this my last page right here. Um, this Togetic is in pretty bad shape, but I like the card, so I kept it. Same with this Koga's Beedrill. Um, and then I got my Evolutions on this page with my Umbreon, a Dark Espeon, regular Espeon, and Vaporeon. These two are hollows. These two are not. All right, so, and then the rest are just empty pages waiting to be filled. I'm actually going to be filling some of that later because I still have down here. <clears throat> bear with me. I still have a bunch of cards to go through that my brother-in-law gave me. So, um, and, you know, I found some pretty cool cards in there. So I'll do that and maybe I'll update you next week, next Thursday, or, or sometime over the weekend with another video. Uh, but thanks for hanging out. If this isn't your thing, then you aren't haven't stuck around this long. <laughs> um, if you did, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. I'm um, going to do the YouTuber thing. Please like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> this feels so weird. Um, I'll get used to it, I'm sure. Um, but yeah, thanks for hanging out with me. Um, and I hope you have a great rest of your day, regardless of what day you're watching this. Um, I will see you next time. Bye.